a tinker man, he's a tinker man, a servant of the worshippers, he... Hello, I'm Tinker, and welcome to Tinker's Tales, where on the screen right here, you will notice that it says redbubble.com slash people slash Tinker's Tales, where you can buy, and I'm just putting it out there, Tinker's Tales, the t-shirt. But there's more to our merchandise than just the t-shirt. For a start, there are several designs. This is one I did myself. There is another one that we hired a graphic designer to do, but I don't think it's as good. But you might think it's better because you are foolish. But you can just get it to uh, see Tinker's Tales right there, telling you where to go. So you too can look awesome. Now I'm standing here today with my fairy jar. And a little invention of mine that I like to call Tinker's Atomic Battery. Hmm, yes, Tinker's Atomic Battery. And of course we all know that atomic batteries are best when powered by fairies. I possibly should have thought about that a little better and raise the fairies up so you could see them glowing through that slit. Maybe I'll do that another time in the next video. But a little later in this video I'm going to be doing a reading from Tinker's Big Book of Wisdom. But until then... I'm going to get our good friend Morales to read Peter the Sampling. I'm sure that's not the real name of the poem, but if it is, it's called Peter the Sampling, uh, but I'm sure Morales can introduce it better than I can. Thank you. Prefer the Simplicity by Linda B. S. Conrad. Of a silent prayer to him that glimmer, the grandeur of a smile so unexpected among strangers more desire that bubble that shine and jingle. Acts of unbridled generosity more covet that precious metals, even sterling laws glutter over time. Those are blessed, not who wear jewels or dress in a sleep and stain. Union bells on their toes, bracelets on their ankles. And thank you, Morales, for correcting me. It was not Peter the Sampling. It was, in fact, something entirely different that I can't recall at the time of recording this video. But what I can recall is that I promised to do a reading from Tinker's Big Book of Wisdom. It was Honora de Balzac who wrote, After all, our worst misfortunes never happen, and most miseries lie in anticipation. Dwight D. Eisenhower said, Unless each day can be looked back upon by an individual, by an individual as one in which he has had some fun, some joy, some real satisfaction, that day is a loss. It is unchristian and wicked, in my opinion, to allow such a thing to occur. Horace wrote, Happy the man and happy he alone, he who can call today his own. He who, secure within, can say, Tomorrow do thy worst, for I have lived today. And one of the great tinkers of all time, Mr. Benjamin Franklin. He's a tinker man, he's a tinker man.